Hello everyone, welcome to the Melax tutorial series. In today's short video, we are going to cover one of the NLP components in the CLAMP toolkit, sentence detection or sentence detector. In natural language processing, deciding the beginning and the end of a sentence is one of the first problems that needs to be addressed. By definition, a sentence is defined as the longest white space trimmed character sequence between two punctuation marks. Exclamation points and question marks are often great indications for the end of sentences because they are relatively unambiguous. However, periods, on the other hand, are unfortunately quite ambiguous. Periods can be used at the end of a sentence, or can be used in abbreviations, or in numbers as well. Therefore, different methods have been developed for detecting sentences. This process is also known as sentence boundary disambiguation, or sentence segmentation, or simply sentence breaking. In the CLAMP toolkit, three different models for detecting sentences are provided. The first model is the DF CLAMP sentence detector. This is a default sentence detector in CLAMP. It is designed specifically for clinical notes, which takes into account the distinctive characteristics of the sentences found in the clinical context. To configure the DF clamp sentence detector, we can double click on the configuration file. Now we have a few parameters that we can modify. Medical abbreviations, section headers, split patterns, and max sentence length. We'll use medical abbreviations as an example. In clinical text, typically there are a lot of medical abbreviations, and sometimes they have punctuation marks at their beginning or sometimes at their end. Providing a list of such abbreviations would help the detector to identify sentences more accurately. By default, CLAMP has provided a comprehensive list of medical abbreviations, which can be found in this default abbreviation.txt. But for your own project, you might want to have a different or a specific list of medical abbreviations. In that case, we can replace the default abbreviation.txt with your own my abbreviations. Or you can also edit the default abbreviation.txt by double clicking on it to get it open in the editor area. Now you can add any terms that you want to include in the abbreviation list. And then click on the Save button to save it. The second method for sentence detection in the clamp is a DF Detect Sentence by New Line. With this method, the detector will identify new sentences using line breaks, so that each line in the file will be treated as a, new, as a single sentence. The third method for sentence detection in CLAMP is the DF OpenNLP sentence detector. To detect sentences, OpenNLP uses a predefined model which is a file named English sentence.bing. This predefined model has been trained to detect sentences in a given raw text. But for advanced users, you can also change the default model to your own model by replacing the English sentence.bing to your own mymodel.bing. So in today's short video, we went over one of the natural language processing components sentence detector. If you find this video useful, or if you are interested in learning more about clinical natural language processing, please don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to our channel. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoy.